Okay, this is a video on how to use flexible fingers, which are involved in collet in a brush stroke. We're not usually actually using our fingers to do a brush stroke, but they need to be flexible. So that's where this all comes into play. Okay, so I first want to start with this little exercise. I want you to kind of make like a duck bill. Go over your bow, sitting on a table like this, you take the duck bill, clamp it. Now you're going to Go down so that your hand is on the table and you have a good bow hand. See the bent thumb? Now go back up into the duck bill. Not on the table. Down, on the table. Duck bill, not on the table. Down, on the table. And when you're on the table, your thumb should be touching its tip, bending right in there like that. Duck bill, good bow hand. Duck bill, good bow hand. Okay, so then I'm going to put it up on the instrument, set your, your bow on your two metal strings. So you can go like this, hold it with your other hand. Make a duck bill, grab the bow with the duck bill, bad bow hand. Set it on the two metal strings. Now roll down into good bow hand. See the thumb? Now duck bill, lift it off. Set it on. Good bow hand. Duck bill, lift it off. Set it on. Duck bill, lift it off. Set it on. Okay, now we're going to play D string. And you're going to just play D. Lift it off. Listen to it ring. Set it down. Now go up. Listen to ring. I want you to set and stop the sound. The good bow hand. Lift. So I'm silently setting, but I'm stopping the sound, the ring. And I'm doing down, set up, set down, set up, set down, set up, set down, set up, set down. You hear the set? set? Set. It's like silent, but it stops the ring. That set is the crucial part.